Hello everyone, this is Merit Trainboy here, and welcome to this one-off special edition of a unboxing review. So, uh, if you have remembered the video where I was unboxing the Takara Tomy diecast Thomas engines, I even got some other stuff that were from eBay along with them, and here what I got here is one of those other stuff. This is the Hornby Special Edition 70th Anniversary Thomas the Tank Engine Metallic Model. And this is, is to uh, represent the 70th Anniversary of Thomas and Friends since uh, Hornby had brought back the Thomas range in really late 2015 and I think this model is to uh, celebrate the 70th anniversary of the Thomas the Tank Engine book you know the the number two book of the railway series But, but yeah, but I think it, but mostly I think, uh, it, this is supposed to uh, celebrate the 70th anniversary of Thomas and Friends and the Railway series. So here, this is what the box looks like. It's got the 70th anniversary logo right there. And there it says Thomas 70th anniversary locomotive, special metallic blue finish. And you can see here, this is why a special, this is a, uh, I should say, a special edition uh, engine is because it says here, limited edition of 1000. So uh, that means there has been a, an, uh, a thousand of these models that were made. So here's the other side of the box and here's the back that's the top and this other side as well and here's the underneath so that's what the box looks like all around it. So uh, let's open it up and take a look inside that engine. Okay so here we are and I'm now uh, gonna open up the box. I just had a sneak peek uh, of it before but I didn't pull the, anything out. So uh, here we are. Here's the Hornby locomotive instructions. This is what it what it looks like for those of you who don't know. And here we what we also got is a, a certificate. And every each of one of these comes with a, a certificate with a certificate and here this is what the certificate looks like and looking right here here it tells me that the this model uh, this is a uh, 176 of 1000 so uh, so it, it looks like that this is telling me that the that this Thomas m model uh, all it in s that I got here is number 176 and yeah I'm one so I wonder who got the 100th model uh, you know that last the last model but I don't know I suppose I guess we'll never know and 
just almost forgot to show you the back. It's just blank. But yeah, like I said, that's what the certificate looks like. Sorry. So, okay. I'm just going to take off the foam that the model's right underneath. Wow. Check it out. There's that Hornby Metallic 70th Anniversary Thomas. And just take a look how shiny that is. And looks really metallic -y. You can see here where I'm putting my finger kind of close to the model. I can see the reflective on it. And not only that, he even has that splash of white on the footplate. So since 2015 when Hornby brought back the range, they had gave the Hornby Thomas that, that classic splash of white on the front of the footplate. So uh, that was a very nice change. So let's just carefully take this model out. Very carefully. Ah, there we go. Here he is. Yeah. And uh, look at that face. Totally looks like more like in the TV series. Yeah. And yeah. And underneath here it says, uh, uh, 2000, 2015 Glenn Thomas Limited. Definitely the same design. I'm just gonna put this box aside and we'll compare this with the old regular Hornby Thomas. So here's the old uh, Hornby regular Thomas that I had uh, over the past few years and here's the 70th anniversary metallic Thomas right next to it. And as we could see uh, between these two models, we there are some uh, um, uh, um a few differences besides the paint, of course. And and like for an example, you can see here the footplate on the old regular Thomas is blue where the other one on the newer Hornby Thomas it's colored white. So I suppose that's to uh, who uh, highlight the real uh, Thomas engine in the TV series. So uh, I wonder if if any of you people prefer this sort of change or if you uh, prefer they would have left it out. Now uh, let's have a look at the faces. Both of these uh, faces do like their selves in the TV series but they also have different detailing. So you can see here the on the old style Thomas, you can see it's kind of like in a creamy color. The eyebrows uh, kind of look like they were from season one. And uh, the eyes, the black dots of the eyes, these look kind of like they're from the cartoon illustrations. And as we and as we take a look at the other face on the new style Hornby Thomas, 
you can see it's in a light shade of gray and the eyebrows look 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 more like in the TV series and the eyes I don't know about you but they're kind of like they're from the CGI series but yeah that those are the differences that Hornby has changed when they have brought back the Hornby Thomas line in 2015. So with any uh, further ado, let's give this metallic Hornby 70th Anniversary Thomas a test run, shall we? So here he is on the track on my HO layout and he is ready to be given a test run. Off he goes. Look at him go, going fast. Well, that was a good test run of that Hornby Metallic Thomas. But let's give him a few more run shots, shall we? So there is the Hornby 70th Anniversary Metallic Thomas that I have got along with the Takara Tomy diecast Thomas engines. And although just to let you know there was some other stuff like I said before that I just got along with the Takara Tomy diecast Thomas engines besides this Hornby model. but. That video will be coming up soon and uh, I am still uh, working on that, trying to finish it up. And uh, it'll be in a few parts. So stay tuned for that recent purchases video of the eBay items that I have got along with the Takara Tomy Diecast Thomas engines plus this. And that's all I got to show you on the 7th Anniversary Hornby Special Edition Thomas the Tank Engine Metallic Model. Hope you enjoyed seeing it. And until next time everyone, this is Merit Trainboy signing off.